and welcome to Interview with the Experts. Today we're joined by Alexandra Bailey, Senior Broker here at Bank the Binary. Alexandra, welcome. Hi, thank you. A few weeks ago we talked uh, to Alex Morrison about his favorite trading strategies. I'd like to ask you the same thing. What are your top tips uh, when it comes to placing successful trades with binary options? Well, when it comes to binary options, there's two ways of trading. You can day trade or you can event trade. I prefer to event trade. So some people, mostly people with some Forex background, will know the concept of hedging. My advice to them would be to try to apply that little trick into binary options as well because it works like magic. Right. What you do is when you have an event, before the actual result comes out, you open two trades. Okay. Okay. One that the value of the asset is going to go up and one that the value of the asset is going to go down. Okay. Now you try to choose that with the smallest expiry time that you can find. Afterwards, when you have the result, not only you get ahead to the people that actually play the trades when the results are out, but you can also get the chance to double up on the winning one. That way, you not only cover for the one that you lost, but you have a guarantee. So it's the safest way of trading, if you ask me. Right. It's that, and also, if you follow the chart, when you have a trend, let's say you have an uptrend, and it moves up, 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 and then it goes up, at some point, it's gonna reach a level where the other side is gonna go over the normal boundaries, and it's gonna reverse. Now, what usually happens with events is you are going to have, if not one, at least two or three fake reversals. Okay. Whereas most people would prefer to try to catch the lowest point in the market to get in, that's usually a type of mentality that was formed with Forex. Because with minor mm -hmm. options, you don't need to have a huge pip difference. You only need the direction. So you can play it safe. So you can wait after the second reversal and just take it from that point on. Okay. That way you have those two trades that you opened up and the second one that you kept doubling up on mm -hmm. that will give you that. And you have the ability to catch the reversal at the safe point and place your trade then. That's great advice. That makes sense. Um, moving on, which economic indicators are you looking forward to most this week? Well, um, mostly this week, I'm just waiting for everything to calm down for the previous week. Quite because, a week last uh, week. <laughs> it was with insane. the yen? With, exactly, with uh, the decision from Japan to um, increase their inflation rate, which led to more quantitative easing and which led to the depreciation of the actual currency. Mm -hmm. That is why at this point, the yen is at its weakest in the last four years. It's getting really Incredible. close to one dollar equaling 100 yen. It's very close to that barrier there. You have that, you also have the gold that last week reached a 12 months low, that's a one year low, and afterwards, obviously, after those two big events, we will have some proper reversals on both the gold and also the yen, and everything that's paired with the yen at the same time. Other than that, on a smaller scale, we will have the unemployment claims. Now, last week, uh, we had an improvement in the numbers, we had an extra 22k over them, now we're not really looking at any major movements, so we're expecting it basically to stay at the same rate that it is right now. But then again, it doesn't really matter because we will manage to binary option hedge it anyway. So mm -hmm. we will find a way to play some successful trades on it. Excellent. Well, thank you for joining us, Alexandra. This has been an interview with the experts with Alexandra Bailey. Join us next week when Alex Morrison is back and he'll be talking us through the decision-making process behind some of his more recent successful trades. And if you have a topic you'd like us to discuss on Interview with the Experts, drop us a line on our Facebook page. I'm Natalie Kiru. Thanks for watching.